Hey guys, it's Oza. Today I want to talk about Chainsaw Man. The second trailer came out for it, and it looks really good. This one finally features the characters talking, and there's some mixed reactions to the voice actors. They didn't sound like how I expected them to, but I think I'll get used to it once the anime begins airing. Besides maybe Denji, he sounds too much like Bakugo to me. But the animation looks really good, it's Mappa, so of course it looked great. I just wish that the art style is a bit more bright, like the cover for the manga. But that's not why I'm worried about the anime right now. The thing that I'm worried about is the fan base that will come out of it. Because you all know how Chainsaw Man is like, right? The fan base is already pretty big, even though it doesn't have an anime on right now. And it's pretty much guaranteed to be the number one anime for the season once it starts airing. You're pretty much going to see it everywhere if you go online, on Twitter, whatever. Much like Spy Family and stuff. So whenever this new seasonal anime become popular in the mainstream and stuff, there's always guaranteed going to be a lot of drama, toxic stuff coming out of it. Mainly from Twitter, because Twitter is accessible of the dark side of humanity. I don't really go on there much, but when I do, there's always something people are complaining about. If something as wholesome as Spy Family can have tons of controversy surrounding it because of the Twitter fanbase, what does that say about this goey 18 plus anime with lots of mature themes inside it? There will be people complaining about this thing. People are going to be complaining about Mappa's production about it, or whining about how the animation quality will dip from here to there, or t talking about, about there's too much gore, you know, this character looks ugly here, or you both, or you they shouldn't show that on anime, or why is power naked here? Whoa! Or something more ridiculous, like I say, like a black person decide to cosplay as power or makima. I 100% bet there's going to be some sort of controversy regarding cosplays. Not to mention how easy it is to cosplay someone like makima or power due to their how simple the uniforms are, or even Aki. There's going to be people complaining about it. Either people are complaining about the simps, people complaining about the cosplayers themselves and making racism mocks or whatever. And then all these anime troopers will be talking about, oh man, Twitter the cesspit, and then will continue to propagate this negative outlook of the community, which will then make people who would be interested in watching anime to not to avoid at all costs because they see that the fandom looks toxic. Because they think that always deviates newcomers from watching a show is the community surrounding it, be it My Hero Academia or Spy Family, I guess, with a small fandom or demon slayer that's a good example and there's also probably gonna be like people complaining about all the waifu roles or whatever so it's like there's so many female characters to show people gonna complain about oh they over sexualize uh wizard or something or oh, power is too over sexualized or something so that's what i'm worried about mainly twitter twitter wounds everything if i'm right about any of these controversies you owe me 20 bucks and if none of these happen, then I'll give 20 bucks. But I highly doubt that'll happen. It's almost guaranteed to have a toxic fandom. And people gonna start saying that the people who watch this are pedophiles or something, I don't know. So my number one tip for all you guys watching the anime is to just shut up and enjoy the show. If you don't like it, stop watching it. If you see someone who don't enjoy the show or complain about it for incorrect reasons or being a generally asshole about it online, just block them and continue on your day. You don't need to continue to complain about the complainers. Just turn, just avoid your social media while watching the show. We've been waiting a long time for this to get animated, so now that it finally is, let's just bask in the positivity of seeing it coming to life. We don't need to maul in the negativity of the small minority of people who'd have a problem with it. And I seriously do not have the energy anymore to see people complain about the anime, be it the show itself or the fandom. And let's face it, with how big social media is to anime now, there's going to be a lot of nasty people inside there just whining about the most tiniest of things or making fusses of the tiniest things. And the anime tubers will gonna report on those tiny things and blow them out of proportion and then the people in their comment section will be complaining about it too. So just enjoy the show. Shut up and enjoy the show. Just watch it. Enjoy it. Talk about it to your friends. 
and do not expose yourself to the greater circle of it. That's about it. See ya.